am Manu Quatra. I am a dancer, like you just saw, and I hope I was able to entertain you well. I hope you all are feeling energized. I hope you all are feeling energized and willing to dance with me, at least in your mind, on the choreography of my thoughts for the next five to ten minutes. Right? Guys, now let's accept. I have this very small idea about dreaming. Dreaming in chaos, dreaming big, and manifesting your dream. That it won't be taking much long. So I'm here for like a few seconds, a few minutes, and what I want all of you to be with me. Give me some applause time in between so that I can stand here a little longer than expected. Yes? Can you? Thank you. Yes. Uh, like I said, I dance, and you just saw it. But apart from dancing, I'm just not a dancer. I am a former business development engineer. I have worked in a corporate for two years. I am a corporate product. I hope many of you will be now in some years. And uh, yes, I am a, a group fitness, Zumba, Boku, and F Squad licensed instructor. I'm also a Psy X for F Squad. And most importantly, I am an entrepreneur and a dreamer. Of all the things I've said, I just want to mention one more thing and focus on one thing, which is I am a dreamer. I'm just a commoner like you, and I am a dreamer. I am a dreamer who dreamt of building a dance studio, no, not exactly the dance studio, who dreamt of building a dance space for himself from his job earnings, savings, so that he can dance his heart out whenever he feels like. But it was never the plan, you know, to open studios, leave the job. But somehow, uh, we now have three studios, three commercial spaces running. We have our app for dance and fitness, and I have a wonderful team. So cheers for my team and the studios I have. Kehte jo socho wo hota nahi hai. I was never supposed to leave my job. But this happened. But how did it all happen? Very simple, tha, yaar. Nee, simple nahi tha. Life simple thi. Quite tough the. Mushkil the. So, during my entire journey of corporate life, I had this idea. I wanted to do a side hustle, and for that, I wanted to collab with different schools, forming a company, and I'll provide dance professionals to the schools where kids can learn dance the authentic way. But it was not happening. It was not at all happening. I was denied entries at the school most of the times uh, by the principal and the guard at the gate. I was not let in. So things were not going as planned. I had a dream. I didn't know the path. I thought I'll create a path. It was not happening. वो कहते हैं ना life simple है life बहुत simple है जनाब बोझ तो ख्वाबों का होता है अभी क्या अभी सिर्फ दो रास्ते एक पाथ मिल जाए या एक पाथ बना लूं बनाने वाला नहीं हो रहा था द पाथ वॉज नॉट है द पाथ केम टू मी द पाथ केम टू मी सम हाउ आई गॉट फ्रस्ट्रेटेड आई वॉज एंग्री एंड द फ्रस्ट्रेशन आई ओपन माई ओन स्टूडियो एंड आई टुक लोन अ बिजनेस लोन and then open a space and expected you know dancers kids to join in i wanted people to dream i wanted people to dream in chaos be who they are and finally i had i had one uh, it was working and of course it was a commercial space uh, we were teaching and choreographing people things were going as planned i had a team i formed a team and we worked really hard to achieve this uh, in spite of all the rejections financial crisis emotional crisis family problems we made it we were doing really well really well and you know this is the first half of the story the first half which was about dreaming right i told you dream dream big i guess i thought my dream was a little small just to open a studio and life in a very good way and bad way <laughs> taught me to dream even bigger During this course of action, I somehow sacrificed my mental health. I didn't know it was, you know, it will happen with me because I used to feel 
that I am the person who can handle any situation and people. And I used to believe that life is all about handling people and situation, may it be any job. But somehow, I didn't know what happened. But yes, after all the struggle, and I sacrificed, I compromised my mental health. And one day, because of some personal trauma, uh, I collapsed. I was nervous, I was anxious. I was uh, suffering from panic attacks, I was not okay. I developed a disease called agoraphobia. I was scared of people, interacting with people. At one time, I was teaching master classes, I was taking workshops. I used to teach 500 students at a time. But right now, I wanted to be in my room. I didn't want to move out. And this was before COVID. So somehow, with the help of my family, and one of a very close friend who's also co-founder of Commotion Studios. I came out of it. And I'm happy to say that I came out of it. <laughs> but this is the second half, I realized this part of my life, which was two, three years, I didn't know where they were. And I wanted to do something about it. I wanted not other artists, or other entrepreneurs suffer like me. So I was thinking about it. Earlier I was rejected by schools, but now somehow dance was acting as a therapy for me. I started again and I was brainstorming what can I do, what can I do, what can I do. And the second half there was this call, da -da ding ding da -da ding ding ding. And there was this call, I picked it up and uh, it was a school principal who saw us, who saw us, you know, struggling and getting to fame in a small town. And he called up for a meeting. Basically, he wanted to collab with us. Now, after 10 years of struggle, so one school called me up, and now they wanted to collab with us. It was a big achievement. <laughs> this was the power of manifestation, I guess. I somehow got it. But now, I just didn't want to be a dance teacher or dancer to provide professionals only for dancing. Now, the concept was to collaborate to hire child psychologist, nutritionist, make a team of dancers and everybody, you know, and present it in an app. So we made an app for dance and fitness and where we were working on the holistic development of a child, but in commotion way, my way. So, and the school agreed to it. We now finally have commotion activity period running in three different schools. And for now, I believe this is the biggest achievement I had because this is what I wanted to do since so long. Uh, yeah, I tell you, let me tell you one thing. There was this dialogue from a movie. I give you this task, you know, to guess the movie. Batana meko kaun si movie hai wo. The dialogue was, in Japan mein, jab koi kimti cheez tootti hai na, to usko liquid gold se sahi kiya jata hai. To wo aur bhi kimti ho jati hai. Aur aap se ada kimti koi hai kya? Nahi hai na, you are the power. अगर आप टूट गए हो अगर मैं टूट गया हूं और मैं अपने आप को अपने एक्सपीरियंस से ठीक करके वापस आया हूं तो आई एम इवन स्ट्रांगर आई एम रिच मे बी नॉट इन मनी बट इन एक्सपीरियंस बट इन माइंड आई नाउ नो हाउ टू डील एंड आई नाउ नो हाउ कैन हेल्प पीपल इट वॉज अ बिगर कॉज नाउ आई वॉन्टेड टू हेल्प पीपल एंड द फाउंडेशन स्टार्ट फ्रॉम किड्स सो येस इट वॉज गुड इनफ फॉर अस we established the subject and we are still working on it i'm still telling you i am i was a commoner and i am a commoner till now but i wanted to do ordinary things extraordinarily yeah the dream was taking its shape and yes somehow i would like to conclude this overall speech or tech talk of mine with a saying i just want you to dream, dare to dream in chaos. This is the chaos of life. And our tagline, chaos of life, you have to dream, you have to stop the commotion of life and rise. This is how you do it, right? Dream big, manifest it, but at the same time, take care of your emotional well-being. Because once you fail, it is tough to come back. I know you'll come back. But what if you start caring from the initial phase? Yes, you can do it. Stay hungry. Stay foolish, guys. This is my time. Thank you.